Namaste and welcome. In this class we are going to work on Vishud, our throat chakra. So we will work on our ability to speak our truth, really listen to our inner voice in order to be able to interact in a peaceful and balanced way. So take a moment to find comfort in your Sukhasana, comfortable seated position with your legs crossed, sitting bones grounded, Bring up the awareness to your spine, crown to the sky, chin parallel to the floor, lift your shoulders up, back and down and just take a moment here to observe your breath, no judgment. Just focus on the flow, on this smooth movement and tune in with it. Tune in with your own energy. Slowly bring palms to your chest, breathing in to three Om. Om. Slowly release your hands. You can stay here with your eyes closed. So we should is linked to the Bija Mantra Ham Ham Ham. So feel the vibration in your throat, in your chest. So we are going to chant hum ten times, breathing in. Hum. 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 
and stay here for a moment. Feel the vibration of hum reaching your chest, your belly, your arms, your palms, but also moving up towards your forehead and your crown. So expanding from your throat in all directions. And visualize this energy as a blue light. Slowly return. Gently place your hands on the mat. Open your eyes. Let's start with gentle circles. So move your head in one direction. Tiny movements to start warming up your neck. widen opposite direction inhale as you move up exhale as you move down Then come back to the center, start rotating your shoulders backwards, so really throw the shoulders up, back and down to warm up this area, and then opposite direction. Moving your shoulders inwards. Big and slow circles. And slowly let go. Now big torso rotations. Warming up the spine from the base. Taking up all the space. And the other way around. back to the center. From here, shoulder breath. So basically inhale and exhale through the nose, shoulders up and down, up as you inhale, down as you exhale. Let's go. Plus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Inhale, inhale, inhale. 
and slowly exhale, 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 release the shoulders, take a deep inhalation and a long exhalation to recovery breaths here, deep inhale, long exhale and return to your natural breathing. And then second cycle, take a deep inhalation and a long exhalation and let's begin. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Inhale, inhale, inhale. And exhale, exhale, exhale to release. Deep inhalation. Long exhalation. Slowly return to your natural breathing and stay with this sensation in your upper back, in your chest, in your shoulders, you feel a, bo a bit more uplifted, a bit more grounded. You've created space in your Vishuddha Chakra Center. Inhale to widen the arms. Exhale, left arm over right arm, eagle arms. So elbows in line with your shoulders, inhale and exhale here, working on your shoulder blades, inhale and exhale, turn to the right, keeping the spine straight, feeling the gentle stretch in your left shoulder. And back to the center, release your arms. One breath here with your spine straight. And then inhale, open your arms, exhale, right over left, eagle's arms. Inhale and exhale.
slowly turn to the left to deepen the stretch in your right shoulder. And back to the center, release your arms, inhale to lengthen crown to the sky, exhale. Focus on your breath, breath and start using Ujjayi, the ocean breath. So we're going to breathe in and out through the nose, but we will engage the throat. Ujjayi basically involves the upper body. We are using our anahat and we should chakras. We're using this energy which works 360 degrees. So we are not just breathing with the front part of the body. We're also breathing with um, the the back part. Five Ujjayi breaths. And slowly make your way to tabletop position. Hands on the shoulders, knees on the hips. Using Ujjayi breath for a full inhalation and a full exhalation. Inhale to Marjari Asana. Exhale. So from tabletop position, we are going to use Ujjayi for five rounds of half Surya Namaskar. So inhale to open the chest, exhale to lower on your knees, inhale to open Exhale to lower. Last round, inhale and exhale into Balasana. Three hum here, hum.
Hum. Inhale to all fours. Tuck your toes. Find your first downward facing dog with your knees bent. Tailbone to the sky. Pressing your hands. Arms rotate externally, thighs rotate internally. Ujjayi breath. Three breaths here, lengthening your legs, heels reach the ground. And slowly walk your feet between your hands. Uttanasana. Rest your belly on your thighs. Option to keep your knees bent. Inhale to Ardha Uttanasana. Lengthening the spine. Hands on your shin or on the mat. Exhale to lower. And inhale to slowly unroll your spine and come to standing. Palms facing up. Tadasana. Breathing in and out. From here we're going to do breath of joy. So we'll break the inhalation into three parts, matching three movements. So exhale all the way down. When you go down, you bend your knees, drop your arms, drop your head. I'll do it once again. And let's begin. So in, 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 exhale. Last round and let go. Stay here for a couple of breaths and then slowly, slowly unroll your spine. Come to standing. Recover in Tadasana. Take a deep breath in. Long breath out. Once again. Feeling uplifted. Safe, stable. Joyful. And full of energy. From here, inhale to raise your arms up. Urdhvastasana. Exhale, Uttanasana.
he inhale to lengthen the spine Ardha Uttanasana exhale to lower step back to find downward facing dog big stretch inhale lift your right leg up exhale step between your hands drop your left knee Inhale to raise your arms up. Exhale to interlock your fingers behind your back. Open the chest and sink. Ujjayi breath. Slowly release your hands, step back, downward facing dog, big stretch, ujjayi, three breaths here. Inhale, left leg up, exhale, step, drop your right knee, find your alignment, find your balance, inhale, raise your arms up, exhale to interlock your fingers, open your chest, ujjayi breath. slowly release step your left foot back find your palakasana plank inhale and exhale to lower Forehead on the mat, hands on the shoulders. So if you have any tension in your lower back, feel free to widen your legs. Keeping your elbows in, we are going to do five Bhujangasana. Remember to keep your shoulders away from ears. So it can be a baby Bhujangasana, so a tiny cobra or a bigger cobra. Up to you. Tune in with your own energy. Inhale, open your chest. Exhale, lower. Ujjayi breath. Last time to stay. Stay here for five breaths. And slowly lower, place your hands under your forehead, maybe sway your hips, 
three hum here. Hum. Slowly return your hands on the shoulders. Inhale to come up. Find you downward facing dog. Big, big stretch. Slowly walk your hands towards your feet. Uttanasana. And unroll your spine to standing. We're going to do Kati Chakrasana, so standing twist. Inhale in the center, exhale as you twist. Inhale and exhale. So let's do it. A few rounds. Inhale. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Inhale in the center and exhale to lower in Uttanasana. Slowly return to your natural breath. Unroll your spine to standing. Slowly open your eyes. Inhale to raise your arms up for a slight back bend. Exhale to Uttanasana. Step back, find your downward facing dog. And from here, lower on your knees, cross your ankles. Come to seated and make your way lying on your back. So heels on the knees, knees in line with your hips, pressing your hands, so strong palms, strong forearms, strong shoulders. We are going to do Chetubandasana half bridge a few times in a dynamic flow. So as you inhale, engage your thighs, engage your glutes. So we are not working on the knees, but on all the muscles in the hip area, in the thighs, 
in the glutes. And exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Last round. And exhale. Now we're going to inhale, interlock our fingers behind the back, pushing hands against the mat and lift the hips. There is no weight on your neck whatsoever. So inhale to lift, interlock, breathing in and out. No weight, no tension in your neck. Glutes engaged, thighs engaged. Chest to chin. And slowly, slowly exhale, release your hand and find your mat. Slowly draw your knees towards your chest. Couple of breaths here to release the tension in your lower back. Extend your left leg, hold your thigh with both hands, breathing in and out, right foot active, slowly bend your right knee, use your left hand to to the left side, open your right shoulder, breathing in and out. And slowly return to the center, both knees to your chest. Extend your right leg, left foot to the sky. Hold your thigh with both hands. Breathing in and out. Slowly bend your knee, right hand, pull your left knee to the right side, look left, breathe in this beautiful twist. Slowly return to the center, both knees to your chest. Now from here, we are going to do Salamba Sarbangasana, shoulder stand. So inhale to lift both legs up. 
try to keep your elbows in. There is no weight on your neck. Look at your big toes. If you're comfortable with Alasana, you can reach your legs over your head. Or you can simply come all the way down. Slowly release the pose with helping hands. Unroll your spine to the floor. Lengthen your legs. Place your hands under your butt. We're going to do Matsyasana fish pose, which is a beautiful counter pose after shoulder stand. So inhale to lift on your forearms and elbow. Lower your crown to the ground, keeping the chest up, pressing on your hands, pressing on your forearms, not collapsing on your head. There is no weight on your head. Inhale to push your chest up, exhale to release, one more time, knees towards your chest. Release your legs, release your arms. And before entering Savasana, we are going to work on our Vishud Chakra, on our throat, through the A U E sound. So we will inhale. And exhale for A, ah, inhale and exhale for U, inhale and exhale for E. So inhale to A. Ah. Ah.
and stay here with this vibration radiating throughout your body your whole body is completely relaxed your mind is still and visualize a bright light entering your third eye and reaching your throat chakra and from there radiating in all directions reaching every single part of your body. I listen to my inner voice. I speak my truth. Slowly return to your body, return to your breath, start moving your toes, your fingers, your ankles, your wrists. Keep your body a very gentle stretch. Slowly bend your knees, bring arms overhead and make your way to the right side. Stay here for one last moment to soak up this beautiful sensation peace and stillness, the sense of belonging, to be one with the universe. Pride yourself for showing up to your sadhana your spiritual and physical practice. And whenever you're ready, come to seated with your legs crossed, lengthening the spine, keeping the shoulders relaxed, the face relaxed. Bring palms to your chest and we'll close the practice with Om and Sishanti. Om Shanti 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 Namaste